and our motto is Game Your Way. So Gnome Travel is a virtual reality game similar to Pokemon Go, and the point of the game is to catch all the gnomes in their gardens when you're walking around. Um, there are rare gnomes, and like different gnomes mean different things on whichever situation you're in. Um, and there are upgrades that you can get, which are for levels one, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay. Um, for levels one, two, three, the upgrades are like they get better every level that you go up. For example, for level three, it's the best one that's on here. It's a big gnome where all the other gnomes can interact with, and where you plant it, like you can come back to that spot and you can get all the gnomes. The game itself is free, but there are in-app purchases which you can get upgrades from. Um, if you're on level five, for example, and you wanna buy upgrades from level six, seven, and eight, that's as high as you can go, but it gets, um, the price gets bigger with every level. Um, the materials that we would need in order to make this happen is workers, um, like employees, and, or I mean people that can design the game. Uh, they would work $5 per level, and their average, the average of levels that we would have, uh, the very first version is 20, so it would be $100 for the whole game. We have friends for building light, electricity, um, software for making the app, um, and 3D app designers that would work $5 per screen, um, and the average screen is like 100, so it would be 500 for the whole game, and then advertisements. And speaking of advertisements, there are ways to advertise. This is social media, business conventions, and the internet, with like the websites. And YouTube ads, like they can't be skipped if they're less, less than 15 seconds. So the best way to make an ad on YouTube is to make it less than 15 seconds. Thank you. Oh, and actually that's not it because there's still more stuff. for levels one through five and six through 11. So with every design, it gets more complicated, which describes how the level gets more complicated. Um, there are opening screens, which obviously have to be designed, but this is just a prototype. Um, this is your opening screen. Um, your account, which you can see what your progress is and what level you're on if you haven't played in a while. Um, this is when you're walking, this is your view of how how you see the gnomes and when you can catch them. And as I said before, these are all the upgrades for levels one, two, three. That's it. All right. Awesome.